Maybe it's it simple. Is. If After we refer to a colleague, we have to refer to a sitting colleague. Once we cease to be judges, they are opinions, not binding dictates. Sir, I have to say something about the basic feature. Please. There's a book by Mr. Andarajuna. Yes, yes. Uh, for the former Solicitor yes. General on the Keshavan and the Bharti case. Yes. Having read the book, my view is that the doctrine of basic structure of the Constitution has a debatable, a very debatable jurisprudential basis. In any case, Honorable Chairman, sir, what the what the bill provides, what the bill provides is diluted form of what federalism, because it's a union territory, not a full-fledged state. See the consequences of this. That means through an executive order, you can change any provision of the constitution because you are you have majority. But this majoritarian culture can cannot destroy the edifice of what our forefathers gave us. So your argument therefore is that you cannot exercise the power under 356 to amend the constitution. Exactly. That point you... Uh, That's right, yeah. and I, they cannot possibly justify it unless there is some new jurisprudence that comes to light that they can do what they like as long as they have the majority. As it is, Malas, now, now one of your esteemed colleagues has said, Malas, that in fact basic structure, those theory is also doubtful. Maybe it's it is. Maybe After, refer to a colleague, we have to refer to a sitting colleague. Once we cease to be judges, they are opinions. Not binding dictates. That's true. Of course, it's not binding, Malad, but I'm surprised. On 11th of November 19, Parliament don't dis doesn't discuss what goes on in the court. No, no, I'm not court discussing anything. I am not discuss what dis goes on in Parliament. <laughs>